Hey guys, if I look a little greasy to you today, it's on purpose because today we are trying out this Hourglass Veil Translucent Setting Powder. This product has already sold out on Sephora more than once, and so it made me really interested in it because it's brand new, um, and there must be something to it if people are loving it this much. Um, it has great reviews too if you go check it out. It's made with diamond powder in it, and that's supposed to help create exactly what it's, it's called, like a veil over your skin. It like extends the wear of your makeup and it helps make it look like you've got almost like a filter. So it's supposed to soften everything, but it's also talc free, which I think is a big deal when you're looking for a setting powder. You don't want something that's gonna like cake up on your skin. So this is supposed to be beautiful for that. So you're supposed to be able to use it to set your entire face. Um, you can also use it to bake under your eyes so that your concealer doesn't really crease or anything like that. So I'm excited because if this is a good translucent setting powder, then, you know, these are really hard to find. A really good one is hard to find. It does come with its own brush, and what I like about this brush is it has it's dual-ended, and it has a really fluffy side for your entire face, and then it has a smaller side that you can use under your eye to bake, so I'm gonna give that a try too. And if Veil sounds a little familiar, one of their main products is this Veil Mineral Primer. I've been using this for years. Um, it makes your skin just feel really, really nice, and so it's just an addition to this collection. Um, they also have, and I'm gonna try this too. This is the Veil Retouching Fluid, and it's a luminizer for under your eyes, a highlighter. Um, and I think this is gonna be really good to use too. So I'm gonna put this on first. Like I said, it's not exactly a concealer. It is more of a luminizer, which um, I'll explain one of these days in another video. But it has its own applicator, and that's awesome. This color is natural, and I'm gonna put it under my eyes. And that's what it looks like. And you can see, because I haven't used a setting powder yet, um, it's a little bit shiny and so is the rest of my makeup. It feels really nice and light. And now we're gonna set it. One of the best things about this product is that it has its own sifter. So you get the right amount of product into the sifter and you're not making a huge mess and you're not like overdoing it. You're just getting the perfect amount and that is super exciting. And obviously you can see a big difference. I'm not shiny anymore. And it feels like it's set it right away. It feels good. It's not settling in. And I'm gonna do the rest of my face. I like it, you guys. It looks really pretty. It feels nice on my skin. I feel like it immediately made my skin look so much smoother, which doesn't always happen with translucent powder. First impression, I think it's great. It looks great. Um, I need to put a little bit of blush on and then my whole look will be set. So let's do that. All right. My makeup look is done. I think that this translucent powder is amazing. It feels great. It costs $46, which is not cheap, but if it's a really nice setting powder, I think it's gonna be one of those staple products that you use every single day. I really think you guys should give it a try. Um, I feel like it just made my skin look so much smoother and prettier. I think it's good stuff. So that is the Hourglass Veil Translucent Setting Powder. I really like it as a first impression. Um, I think this is gonna become a staple um, in my makeup set. I think um, I'm gonna be using this product a lot. Tell me in the comments below if you're gonna give it a try, if you've already tried it, what you think of it. Um, find me on Instagram, subscribe, give the video a big thumbs up, and apparently you need to turn on notifications now to even know that my videos are popping up. So if you want to do that, please turn on notifications and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.